All right, the graph of g of x equals x plus 1 over x has two x-intercepts and no y-intercept, two x, one, one. Okay, obviously the easiest thing, you could go graph and you could quickly see what's happening. When I see this, the first thing I'm thinking is where are the asymptotes, right? Because usually you have an asymptote here and sometimes here. So where are the asymptotes? Well, what we do to determine the asymptotes is we usually remember for the horizontal asymptote, which might be right on the y-axis, meaning you're not going to touch right on the, excuse me, x-axis, meaning you're not going to be touching it uh, if it's at y equals zero. Let's see. So we have the crazy Bobo Botten eats DC. Now, remember, if it's bigger on bottom, it's y is equal to zero. If it's bigger on top, there's none. And then exponents are the same. We divide the coefficients. Well, here the exponents are the same. They're both x to the first. So we divide it. So we know that at y equals one, there's going to be an asymptote. Okay. So we know on our graph right here, you're never touching one. You are never touching that space. Well, then, so we know that. Okay, great. What do we know about the other? Well, if I want to figure out the vertical, just set the bottom equals zero. Well, that's going to happen when X is zero. So that's right here. This tells me because this is right here, it tells me you're never touching the Y axis. There is no Y intercept. So it's got to be one of these two guys. Two X intercepts. Maybe the line crosses twice. I mean, it could do what here, but see this other guy's going to be bound up in here. So if we look at it, which would be the easiest and most obvious thing to do. Okay, I did it here for you. X plus one over X. We can see it crosses right here. It crosses the uh, X axis. So we know it's crossing the X axis. And we can see that it approaches the Y, but never does. And it only crosses the X axis in that one spot. This graph right here, he never is going to, touch the x-axis nor the y. He keeps getting closer and closer, but never is going to touch. So our answer is it's going to be, had, it has one x-intercept that we saw right there, but it never touches the y. And again, I'm just sort of giving you extra bits to think about here to sort of picture what's going to happen. But again, when it gives me most things, I'm going to go to Desmos and be able to answer the question very easily.